This is a custom MHS lightsaber hilt. I'm calling it Noble Radiance because I like for a lightsaber to have a name. And it's comprised of MHS parts um, from the custom saber shop. And so we have the emitter section, the choke section, the body, and the pommel. And what's neat about this design, you guys, is it's a little similar to the Leia lightsaber, especially with this kind of added copper powder coating to it and the radiator style emitter. Although it's a bit more of a simplified design and it's certainly not a carbon copy of it, but I like that the design is a bit similar. And I'm gonna go over this the pieces for you guys so you could actually kind of assemble a similar lightsaber if you like from the custom saber shop um, from components from the custom saber shop so if we start at the emitter though uh, we have this kind of really cool copper vein um, you know powder coating added to it in the case of the emitter section the copper vein powder coating kind of serves as a accent coloring to the emitter whereas we have the same coloring in this lower part of the hilt and that just sort of coats the entire section so it's really cool here to see the contrast between well just kind of keeping that standard finish on the kind of rings of the um, emitter and then having the copper accents in the other parts of it now on the top of this hilt we have a little bit of weathering a little bit of like kind of tarnish weathering going on there you can see it's empty uh, so this is an empty hilt and this piece if you want to look for it from the custom saber shop this is an mhs v1 blade holder style 14. and there is an added thumb screw on this so this is kind of this knurled thumb screw added here and that could serve as a uh, blade retention screw now below that is the choke piece so this doesn't have any added coloring to it, um, it and this is the MHS V1 choke style one short and so that's kind of one of the common standard um, you know pieces you'll see from the custom saber shop there and the, you know the color this kind of standard color the metallic silver color uh, ties together with some of these um, you know unpowder coated sections at the top of the hilt. Now below that we have the main body of the hilt. Okay, this is MHS V1 um, hilt body style five, and it has some gorgeous fluting around the kind of grip section. So that's pretty cool. And you can see that this entire piece is basically powder coated and it's powder coated with that same really gorgeous copper vein um, powder coating. And the copper vein powder coating is one of the textured uh, powder coating options offered by the Custom Saber Shop. Let's see if we can get this to show. Get some of the texture. There we go. So you can see great texture. Um, the Custom Saber Shop offers, uh, I think it's about maybe three different textured options and this is one of them for the powder coating. All right. So that was the kind of body of the hilt. And then finally we get to the pommel. So this is kind of one of the standard pommels, <clears throat> standard pommels that they offer. Has a little bit of a taper to it. This is MHS pommel style four. And then it has this uh, brass MPS pommel insert style one on the bottom as well. So we'll take a look at that. And then that is attached. There's a few different ways you can attach those pommel inserts. And this one has the um, kind of C-clip on the inside. So it's a pretty cool hilt, you guys. I like it. I like that it, um, you know, is a little bit similar to the Leia lightsaber in the Rise of Skywalker, but it's also more simple in its design. And it's definitely not the same, you know, as that hilt design, but, it has some similarities to it, and just this copper vein powder coating is gorgeous. I'm a big fan of it, and it just looks really nice on this hilt. So uh, yeah, this has been a look at a custom MHS lightsaber. I'm calling it Noble Radiance, and it's a little bit of a Leia-style lightsaber, but kind of, sort of, maybe not really, um, and it's comprised of parts from the custom saber shop. So feel free to comment below.